Welcome back, folks. The Southwest Queen of Rock and Roll, born in El Paso and now residing here in Albuquerque, Mozzie D, has an unmistakable sound, and it is being noticed. In an interview for Vintage Rock Magazine's June 2022 edition, she has been named one of the top 10 hot prospects of the vintage rock scene. Mozzie D is also nominated for Rockabilly Female of the Year with the Ameripolitan Awards 2022. Here to talk more about this nomination, her career, and where we can follow her online, Mozzie D herself. Congratulations on all the accolades, very well deserved. Um, how did you get started in Rockabilly? I actually got started with it actually through the pinup scene and going through uh, to car shows with my dad. Um, that was okay. like, that is still our best pastime together. That's and, awesome. Uh, my dad actually had me grow up in the custom culture scene mm -hmm. um, that way. And then I, I started listening to the music and I really got into it. And I just had like this old soul kind, like, kind of feel to it. And I, I had to be a part of it. And it, I felt like it really spoke to me mm -hmm. and I was able to sing my life through it and really yeah okay. that's why i got into it <laughs> who do you think who who do you accredit as some of your biggest influences uh etta james uh patsy klein is a big oh, one yeah. um especially because my grandpa really loved patsy klein okay. uh, and she has a lot of ro rock and rollers too not a lot yeah. of people know about that um she was a uh, first rockabilly before she became a country artist no kidding so. I didn't yeah know that. um and veretta dillard ruth brown there's a lot of uh, really good uh Rhythm and blues influences in rockabilly also. Okay. Um, Janice Martin. We have uh, the unknown artists too that not a lot of people know about, like mm -hmm. Jan Moore and Barbara Pittman. A lot of people that paved the way for rock and roll today. Really? Yeah. Okay. Um, now let's talk about this nomination, the Ameripolitan Awards. Before we get into the nomination, what is this uh, this organization, and wh why why is this such a prestigious nomination? The Ameripolitan Awards was created by Dale Watson and Celine Lee out in Memphis, Tennessee. Okay. Um, they're the owners of Fernando's Hideaway. Uh, Dale, Watson's, Dale Watson is an outlaw country artist, and Celine Lee also sings to um, Honky Tonk. And they wanted to promote people that don't really get recognized mm -hmm. in that, those categories. Uh, the Ameripolitan Awards honors rockabilly music, uh, outlaw country, western swing, and mm -hmm. uh, honky-tonk artists that are still going strong today yeah. and bringing that country and Ameripolitan feel and music to the world today. Okay. And they wanted to acknowledge them. Now, what is cool about this is that people can vote on, on this, so we can go online, listen to you, and vote, is that right? Yes, okay. um, you can vote at ameripolitan.org and vote for all of these artists. I tell you, these artists are so amazing, they're talented, they deserve the recognition and the nomination in itself. Mm -hmm. um, it's just an honor to be up there with these people. That is fantastic. Yeah. Now, uh, speaking of your music, we do have uh, uh, one of your original works filmed by Botflix Films, yes. is that right? Okay. Yes. Uh, let's take a look at Let's Stroll. Don't have to be a pro just to get up on your feet. Don't have to be a star just to get up from the sea. Girls, I know your man and it's love and that's true. All the ladies want to rock and roll the way they do. So let's stroll. Come on, ladies, let's stroll. We can shimmy and shake. 
Fantastic. So voting now open through December 1st, the Ameripolitan Awards. Where do we go online to vote and where do we find you on social media? You can go online at ameripolitan.org. Um, you can find me at mazidmusic.com, mazidmusic on Instagram and Facebook, and on social media anywhere. Fantastic. <laughs> Best of luck. Uh, we're we're going to be hearing a lot more of you coming up, Mozzie. Uh, if you want more information about Mozzie D, how you can vote for her, just head over to nmliving.com. We're going to have links there a little bit later on today. Stay with us. We'll be right back.